Welcome to Electron Line. Now let's talk about the probability of an event not occurring. For example, the probability of not A. So a way of looking at it is, what is the probability of an event not occurring? And what we need to keep in mind is that the probability of an event occurring plus the probability of an event not occurring always equals one. And that's the key of how to deal with that. So, in other words, when we see something like this, the probability of not A, what we're really saying is, what is the probability of all other events occurring? And so, therefore, what we then do is we can write that the probability of not A is equal to 1, which represents the probability of all events occurring, including A, minus the probability of A occurring, which then leaves us the probability of all other events occurring. For example, Let's say we throw a single die, and we want to know the probability of not throwing a 5. Well, that is equal to 1, which represents the probability of all numbers, 1 through 6, minus the probability of throwing a 5. Since there's 1 sixth probability that we'll throw a 5, we then take 1 minus 1 sixth, and we then get the probability of all other events, which means that's the same as the probability of not throwing a 5. And that's what we mean by the probability of an event not occurring.